It is incredible how much we rely on weather forecasts and so-called local temperatures. The truth is that those values available online or through apps come from weather stations that can easily be dozens of miles away. Nothing beats measuring the values by yourself right where you are. But that's just not possible and silly. So, we have created the world's smallest weather station that can easily fit in your palm. Simply plug WeatherPoint into your device and start the app. Simple as that. It consists of four sensors for temperature, humidity, atmospheric pressure and ultraviolet radiation. With this information, you can have the most accurate weather forecast anywhere you are. Also, by measuring atmospheric pressure, you can know your altitude more precisely than GPS devices. You can also measure UV radiation and limit your exposure to these harmful UV rays. The housing is made from aluminium and titanium and ensures longer lifetime. When you're not using WeatherPoint, it is safely placed on your keychain so you don't have to worry about losing it. WeatherPoint doesn't use a battery. Well, who likes them anyway? It doesn't even require internet connection. But building hardware is costly. We invested a lot of resources into making WeatherPoint possible. The Light Blue Bean Plus. The Light Blue Bean Plus is the easiest way to get started with Bluetooth Low Energy. You can program it wirelessly from all of these different platforms, and making a smartphone control project is as easy as downloading an app. And this time, we increase the range of the Bluetooth signal. How much, you ask? A lot! And still, it runs up to a year on one of the included LiPo batteries. We added a bunch of new Bluetooth profiles. So now you can make even cooler bean projects. I made a telegraph keyboard. You just can't get that same genuine feeling from a modern day keyboard, you know? I made a wireless MIDI guitar. I made a home automation system. What is up with that song? No. Nope. Definitely not. That's better. I made an email notifier. I better reply to that. I made a button that donates a dollar to charity every time you press it. In 2006, Apple introduced this, the Magnetic Charging Adapter. It revolutionized the charging experience for MacBook users. It's compact, simple, and safe. It prevented unwanted accidents and made charging easier. But that was almost 10 years ago. So why hasn't something similar been made for our mobile devices? We ventured into tackling this challenge last year, and we call it Snaps. With Snaps, you can charge your mobile device in the easiest way possible. For when you only have one hand free. Or you're in a hurry to head out. Snaps is all about making your life just a bit more convenient. It also protects your phone wherever you are. One of the biggest hurdles in designing Snaps was its compact size. We wanted to make sure that it is compatible with any phone case you might have. To achieve that, we custom made many of the internal components. After numerous prototypes and countless hours of testing, we've finally condensed snaps into the size of your fingertip. Quick, simple, convenient. It snaps. We love video games. 
And we know that phones and tablets are the consoles of the future. There's just one drawback, though. Physical controllers gave us a level of tactile response and immersive experience that's completely lost on touch screens. Your fingers are just in the way. When they're not sliding off the control surfaces, they're getting in the way of the action. So we've decided to get rid of fingers. No more fingers. We've developed a small guillotine to get rid of your fingers. That's very good. <laughs> So, we conceived, designed and built the world's smallest wireless Bluetooth controller for smartphones and mobile devices. The Impulse supports hundreds of games right out of the box. No jailbreaking required. Now, if you're a core gamer, you probably have thousands of legacy titles, emulators, all that great stuff just crying out for some controller love. You're in luck. The Impulse supports them. And it fits on a keychain, which is great because it's also a key finder. We've added a camera remote to this thing. You can take a picture of yourself or a group from a distance. One story stands above the rest though. In the winter of 2011, we launched a tiny thermometer app. We called it Thermo. It was one of those projects we built because we thought it would be fun and different. Apparently, we weren't the only ones who thought this was a neat idea. To this day, we've had more than 2 million downloads and hundreds of thousands of happy users around the globe using it every day. Unfortunately, not everybody seemed to like it. I checked the temperature in my bathroom and then went to our fireplace and it still said minus 2 degrees. It doesn't work. It's a waste of time. One star. This gave us a good laugh. The thermometer analogy we used in the app was obviously displaying the outside temperature, as the iPhone unfortunately can't measure the immediate temperature around you. But it got us thinking, what if it could? We teamed up with an electrical engineer and started working on a prototype. If we could only build an external temperature sensor that had the same simplicity as our apps, After months of iterations, we're pretty excited to show you Thermodo, the tiny thermometer. With this little electrical thermometer, you can now record accurate temperature readings from the palm of your hand. We designed a tiny sensor in a sturdy housing. We even designed a little keychain so you'll always have it with you. All you need to do is stick the moto in your audio jack of your device and it'll immediately measure the temperature. We're building the moto in both black and white along with a premium anodized aluminum edition, just like the iPhone. While this obviously works with Thermo and our other apps, we're building a custom iOS app that will work as a companion app to Thermodo. We even want to take it a step further and give developers access to an SDK so they can build their own temperature aware products to any platform they like. Thermodo aims to give you a sleek little thermometer. Accurate and expertly built hardware that you can have with you everywhere. How much is it actually freezing outside? Temperature values available online or through apps comes from weather stations that can easily be miles away, so nothing beats taking the measurement yourself right where you are. With the Moto, you can easily track and share your personal temperatures. But we need your help. Building hardware is costly, and to get to the next stage of production, we'll need molds, components, and factory time. We already have working prototypes of Thermodo, but now we need the funds to start producing your new thermometers. Choose one of the pledges below and help us turn bad app reviews into a great new product. Introducing the NFC Ring, wearable technology that can be used to unlock doors and mobile phones, transfer information, link people and much more. 
If you've not heard of NFC, it stands for Near Field Communication, a wireless technology that can transfer data over very short distances. Built into the ring are two tiny transmitters, one for public information, the other for private data. That's all. No batteries, no need for charging, no fuss. Just a low-profile ring that can be worn all the time to help perform everyday tasks simply by touching your hand against an NFC-enabled device. So, what can it do? It can unlock your NFC-enabled phone without the need to enter a pin or even touch the screen. Grab yourself an NFC door lock and it can lock and unlock your door. Use it to share information, Wi-Fi passwords, links to websites or photos, contact information or anything else you think is suitable to be shared with your friends' devices. It can be set to hold your public Bitcoin address, for example, so you can receive payments. Or you could use the NFC ring to automatically launch apps with custom settings, making it a really easy way to personalise app experiences to match your ring. On top of all that, the software we've developed is open source, so you're free to invent your own uses and create applications to have it act however you want. This is just the beginning. We've got big plans for the NFC ring, and we believe that this tiny piece of wearable technology can make a big difference. Thanks for watching, and thank you for your support.